Welcome to the YouTube channel from Carbonworks. My name is Simon Bühler and today I would like to show you a little bit more about the Darimo stem and the computer mount we developed for the stem. The version I have here has 100 millimeters in length and its weight is 69 grams. This is a stunning light white stem and of course we had to develop a solution for this and for your Garmin or Wahoo computer. The cockpit mount doesn't fit to the stem due to the M4 screws so we have this special version which comes in a box like this. We also added an extension and adapter for your torque wrench and now I would like to show you how you fix it on the stem. At first we replace those two screws here and also the cross nut bolts which are on the back of them. We will not need those two cross nut bolts anymore because these are integrated in the computer mount. As you can see here, the trick is we will place them the other way around so the cross nuts bolt are in front and the screws are coming from behind. This is the reason we need this extension for the torque wrench because otherwise we wouldn't um, it wouldn't be possible to fix the screws here with this little bit of space left behind. I will just show you how you can use this adapter with a torque wrench. Um, I will just put them on a little bit to show you how it should work. Well, now we have added about 10 grams. The white is now at 79 grams. But sadly, this is not everything. What we need now is the adapter for your computer. In this case we have a Garmin adapter with the two screws and this is at 3.7 grams. There are lighter adapters on the market but I've chosen to use the heavy ones because these are a little bit stronger and hold your computer very safe. I will just place it on the mount now. For this I always recommend a toolbox like this, a tool set you can get it on eBay or Amazon for about 20 bucks and with this it's very easy to put on all those small bolts and screws here. So now we can put on our first computer. I have a Sigma ROX 12 here which is one of the biggest computers I have and you can see it fits perfectly. Another computer, a little bit smaller, is the Garmin Edge 1000. Um, but you can see this one also looks very nice on the stand now. If you have a smaller computer, for example um, here the Sigma ROX 11, um, we will see soon that this is not as perfect as we would like it to be. We have a big gap here between the computer and the stem. Well, and of course we have a solution for this problem. We have two different types of computer mounts on our web shop available. The first one here has no possibility to adjust the angle. The other one has the front elements from our cockpit mount and with them you can adjust the angle and also the length. I will show you how it works by just replacing these elements with the ones from the cockpit mount. will just take a few seconds. And then we can also So, so now we can adjust the angle by just opening the screws a little bit and also have the computer closer to the stem. 
It would be possible to bring the computer even nearer to the stem, but I want a small gap here to show you the full range of the angle. Um, there are a lot of Darimo stems with a negative degree or even going upwards. So if you have your stem going like this, it would be okay, but if you have a stem going downwards, it wouldn't be so nice having your computer looking downwards too. This is no problem with our computer mount. You can adjust the angle. For the last step, we just have to fix the position of the computer and have it finished directly in front of us and in the exact position we want it to be. So thank you very much for watching this video. To be honest, this was my first video in English and I hope it was possible for you to understand me. There will be some more videos soon, um, especially about the computer mounts we have and maybe a video about the bottle cage and some other products which are coming soon, I hope this summer. And well, if you have any questions, just leave a comment under the video. Uh, follow us on YouTube or maybe Instagram. Thank you very much and goodbye.